Good evening folks, Alien Addict here. I want to talk to you all about the Go Faster video and the video that I put out in response to what happened where I saw the security team video and the link and the actual link disappeared while I was editing it and then it turns out that it was just a video placed over another video. It is what it is. I've learned from that. I wish you could do that on YouTube. But yeah, a lot of you um, made your opinions known um, and I respect every one of your opinions. So I started out, if you watch some of my older videos on Tom DeLonge and the To The Stars Academy, I'm well in favor of it. And then I kind of went off the mark in that last video and thought, you know what, there's something going on here. There's something a little bit untowards and then I've seen some recent news that um, uh, one of my subscribers, Gordon, uh, sent me um, that NASA may be sending two bits of UFO footage to the to the sky, to the Stars Academy. So I've been looking into that today, and I found out that. A channel's promoting that called whatever that says that I'm putting up on screen now. I cannot read that. It, I think it's Spanish or Mexican. Um, my wife wouldn't be able to read it. She's from Ecuador. So when I go to this 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 channel and I go to the video in question, it's actually deleted. But another channel has put this footage out. I'll show you a clip of this right now. Here we go, check this out. About it, please don't ask me questions, but a friend of mine that works for NASA, very close uh, uh, source, uh, and, and they're, you know, they're, they're credible sources, you know, uh, that, that I deal with, you know. And, and he told me that uh, NASA has released two videos to Luis Elizondo for the disclosure project. Uh, now, obviously, uh, we're gonna see something clear. Uh, we're gonna see something that's uh, very credible uh, Without being challenged that it's probably a fake or altered whatever. I don't know. I mean, we don't know But if NASA wants to release two videos, let them let them do it. You know, let's not scare them. Let's encourage them So please keep your comments your opinions uh, reasonable don't don't uh, discredit this information as saying that I'm just hoaxing everything or or you know uh, false alarm or uh, uh, what they called it, uh, fake news? No. But the most impactful sighting was yet to come. This happened while Maurizio was photographing, at the insurance company's request, damage to his home in Alvin. I took a picture and it just happened to come out real clear. Uh, so in my eyes, after watching that, it's clear that the guy's talking bollocks and he's just made up all that shit just to start something off, he may even have a collab with the channel that put this out, I don't know. Um, I'm going to leave the link to the full interview in the, in the description. But I don't trust it for one second. I think something really strange is going on. And I kind of want to get to the bottom of it. But I urge all YouTubers, do your subscribers justice. Your subscribers are there, they're like a family, you know. My subscribers, awesome people, I talk to every single one of you. If I miss one of your comments, I am sorry. And even if you call me a twat, I do respond to that. But something weird's going on. And I don't know how much I trust any of it anymore. Um, I want to see, I want, I want it to be, I want to see truth. I don't think we're getting it. I think the, the whole YouTube thing, the whole media thing, the whole Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all of it is fucking with ufology. You know, yeah, yeah, and other stuff. This is, I mean, there's much more pressing matters, but it's it's just, you don't know where to trust, what to sponsor, what to pay money for. I'm here for truth. Damn fucking right I am. And I want you guys to just step back and think about what you're watching 
and the reason why it's been put out because I've been blinded so many times by different stuff. Now, I'm not saying that To The Stars Academy is a load of shit. I think Tom DeLonge's probably got, you know, his, his heart's in it. I do think that. A lot of people say he's a front man. I don't know, I've got a lot of passion for it though and I will be following it really closely but one thing I have noticed I've been watching back the different um, news channels that's putting out the pilots, putting out the pilots' view of the event, and in the main one that's on the To the Stars Academy YouTube channel, there is 15 cuts. Just watch this now. Just watch a couple of these cuts that I'll put on here. There's 15 in this entire video. Why is it cutting that many times? Uh, Fast Eagle, which was the call sign, Fast Eagle 101, 102, I can't remember exactly what our numbers were. They said, hey, we're going to cancel the air defense exercise um, and we have real world tasking. And I said, okay. And they gave us a vector 270, which means go west, um, and they start calling out the intercept. We had our radars made at about 20 miles and we're looking out. So, so we've got a pretty good, pretty good swath of the air that we're scanning. So as we start tracking out to the west, they're calling. So generally speaking, when I when I do a YouTube video, I try not to have too many cuts, and if I do fuck up, I just keep it in. But it seems fifteen fuck ups in a, in a an interview, fifteen fuck ups for something that's true events. I question it. You've got to. I'm not saying this guy's a liar, and I'm not saying to the Stars Academy is talking shit. I'm just saying we need proper answers. We need to hit in the chair. Need a new chair. Uh, we need proper answers. We need proper people talking about this. We need more YouTubers that are there for truth on this. And if you look at the actual news from the Fox News interview, this guy looks like a fucking zombie. Check him out. So from what you know about aerodynamics, mechanics, physics uh, should this be possible what you saw not with the technology that we have today you see what i mean so the more i watch stuff on this it's not sitting right i hope that i'm wrong and i hope that i'm going to see amazing footage and i'm seeing so much stuff on project blue beam at the moment yeah i did it i did it a chat with my mate, we were drunk and we were talking about the pigeons. Some of these channels could possibly be right, you know. Some of these channels that are saying it's not alien, it's not UFO, it is something different, could be right. I, I mean, I'm not a religious man. But do I know? Do I know what alien is? I don't. I mean, you look at my logo. I drew that logo. I started off drawing just like a little cute grey. Ended up something more sinister and that's kind of in my head. This here, so I made that. I started off making a an alien grey head. I couldn't do it; it just turned into something weird. So I, I yeah, it's a bit <laughs> woo. Um, yeah, that's another thing. But I I question all of it. I want to see. I want to see the truth. I really do. But I think if we don't question it together and we don't start researching in other stuff other than just ufology, just UFO footage, just people's terms of the events, we're not going to get anywhere. And if we watch a bunch of dickhead YouTubers saying that this is how it is and so-and-so's going to destroy blah, 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 and there's going to be a UFO invasion in so many years to come and bloody Nibiru's gonna come and destroy us, blah, 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 load of shite, then we're all becoming sheep. So I want you to really listen. If I mean, if I wasn't dyslexic, I would read a fucking book. But you know what, I have common sense. I've learned to go around the dyslexicness ism Dyslexicism, yeah? I've gone round it different ways. Sometimes I have to watch the shit. I've, but I sift through so much shite on the internet to get to the real stuff. And I'm passionate about it. I will look 
everywhere, Francis. You look at, you go, you rewind my channel, go way, 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 way down. You'll see, I was a totally different channel. And I put out a lot of shit that I genuinely thought was real. Maybe it is real. I don't know. Maybe I was right about some of that shit. I hope it was. But yeah, guys, I'm Alien Addict. Subscribe, like, and share my shit.